How's it going for one? This is Shadow Trainer 1030, and today we got some interesting stuff to go over in this concerning Jurassic World Live. Ludia has revealed this week's event schedule. When we're doing this video, I'm going to be telling you all what the event had to offer. I'm going to get my thoughts on it, etc. But first, before I get into it, I do want to mention that if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my channel for a chance to win a special giveaway. If you're new and not familiar with it, if my channel reaches 5,000 subscribers, I'm going to pick a winner to receive in town Switch. Also, that first choice, Pokemon Sword or Shield with the expansion pass. Other thing is that if my channel reaches 10,000 subscribers, I'm going to pick a winner to see a big special prize. More details will be at the end of the video. Be sure to check it out. How much terms go by sharing with your first advantage meal or favorite share at the appreciate it. With all that being said, let's go and get into it. If you take a look screen next to me, the theme for this week's event schedule will focus around Camp Cretaceous. It's going to be from June 21st till 27th. Let's first go over the featured creature himself, Damn Gorge Right Towers. From Monday to Tuesday, you will have an opportunity to dart Dimorphodon, Stegosaurus, and or Molosaurus Gen 2. They have hybrids. Now, the one I recommend darting the most is Molosaurus Gen 2. The reason because it recently got a brand new hybrid. Wednesday to Thursday, you will have an opportunity to dart Baryonyx Gen 2, Carnotaurus, and or Tyrannosaurus Rex Gen 2. Like I said with the comments, these ones have hybrids. Now the one I recommend darting the most is obviously Carnotaurus, reason because, like I said with Molosaurus Gen 2, this one has a brand new hybrid. Friday to Saturday, you will have an opportunity to dart Blue, Bumpy, and or Compy. Like I said already, with the common and rares, these ones have hybrids except for Bumpy by taking this video. The one I recommend darn the most is Compy. Reason because its hybrid is very difficult to make due to this one has to be at level 20 and it's 200 per fuse. Sunday, you only get one attempt to dart either Parasophis Lux or Scorpius Rex. So I recommend darting which one you are close to either unlocking or leveling up. Getting to the strike towers, Monday you have a standard common friendly, standard at a beginner, a sense strike beginner, a rare incubator advance. Tuesday you have a standard rare experience, standard at a beginner, a epic expert strike. You also have yourself a stat boost strike, advance books around damage. Wednesday, you have a standard common friendly, standard rare friendly, a rare incubator experience focused around Tyrannosaurus Rex Gen 2. You also have yourself a standard epic experience. Thursday, you have a standard rare experience, standard epic beginner, a sense strike theme that will be experience, a stat boost strike advance focused around health. Friday, you have a standard common friendly, standard rare friendly. A epic master strike focused on Baryonyx. You also have yourself a standard epic experience. Saturday, you have a standard rare experience, standard epic beginner, a rare incubator experience. You also have yourself a stat boost strike, advanced focus around speed. Sunday, you have a standard common friendly, standard rare friendly. You also have yourself a epic master strike. Also, with a epic uh, expert strike. That's everything the event schedule has to offer. Overall, it's decent. At least it's a lot better than the previous one. That's my personal opinion. You guys have your own opinion. That's all to cover for today's video. The purpose of this video is to let you know about the event schedule for this week. I give my thoughts on it, etc. Let me know in the comments below your thoughts on every cover here. Are you looking forward to the event schedule? Which dials are you playing to dart? Let me know. I appreciate it. Hope you all did enjoy today's video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Check my channel's subscribe bell for more gameplay videos. And as usual, I will see you all in the next video. Until next time, hopefully you all are staying safe, being healthy, and keeping each other safe. <laughs>